Hello, I welcome you to this channel again. Today we are going to know why Chandrayaan 2 cannot take off from Earth and go directly to Moon without orbiting around Earth for 23 days. Very large amount of fuel is required to send spacecrafts outside the Earth's gravitational influence. The velocity required to take spacecraft outside the Earth's gravity is called as escape velocity. Escape velocity of Earth is 11.2 km per second. Launching vehicles or boosters are used to take off spacecrafts from Earth's surface. The launch vehicle used for Chandrayaan-2 mission was Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle Mark III. In short, GSLV MK3. GSLV Mark III is ISRO's highest payload capacity launch vehicle. Payload capacity of GSLV Mark III is 4000 kg for geosynchronous transfer orbit, which is 10,000 kg for low Earth orbit. Payload means the things to carry. Payload of Chandrayaan-2 contains Vikram Orbiter and Pragyan Lander. Orbiter and lander contains cameras, spectrometers, radars, experiment instruments, etc. GSLV Mark III cannot reach escape velocity of Earth. That's why Chandrayaan-2 couldn't be sent for moon directly. The launch vehicle used by NASA in Apollo 11 mission was three-stage Saturn V, which was capable to reach escape velocity of Earth. Of course, manufacturing and fuel cost of NASA's Saturn V launcher is very high as compared to ISRO's GSLV Mark III. In Chandrayaan-2 mission, Earth's gravity is to be used to save fuel to reach Moon's orbit. That's why Chandrayaan-2 is sent into geosynchronous orbit by launch vehicle GSLV Mark III. Chandrayaan-2 will orbit Earth elliptically 170 km by 45,475 km above the surface of Earth. Step by step, its orbit will be raised and finally Chandrayaan-2 will escape from Earth's orbit towards Moon. The first Earth-bound orbit raising was performed on 24 July 2019. Chandrayaan-2 was raised to 230 km by 45,163 km Earth orbit. On 6th August, last time orbit of Chandrayaan-2 will be raised. For orbit raising, propulsion thrusters are used. On 14th of August, Chandrayaan-2 will escape Earth's gravity and propagate towards Moon. This is called as translunar injection. In short, TLI. TLI will also be performed by propulsion thrusters. In conclusion, the reasons for Chandrayaan-2 cannot take off from Earth and go directly on Moon. First, to save fuel. As to escape from Earth's gravity, bigger launcher will be required, which will consume large amount of fuel. Second, to reduce cost of project, as raising orbits of Chandrayaan-2 will take it close to Moon. Orbit raising doesn't take that much fuel. Also, Earth's gravity is used to increase speed of spacecraft. That's why cost of this mission is very low. Third, ISRO doesn't have launch vehicle which can take a spacecraft directly out of Earth's gravity. In the developing country like India, these types of missions are affordable. This mission is much lower but cost of this mission is only 978 crores which is much lower than lunar missions by NASA and European Space Agency. That's all for today's video. I hope you found it to be informative. Subscribe to this channel and for regular updates press bell icon. Thanks for watching.